Welcome to this ANSYS innovative course on Response Spectrum Analysis. Consider a multi-story building or a suspension bridge under earthquake loading. Engineers would like to determine the peak response of the structure. However, conducting a time history dynamic analysis can be highly time-consuming and computationally expensive. Response spectrum analysis is an alternative method to approximate the maximum response of a structure exposed to the short, non-deterministic, and time-dependent loading conditions. It is a mode superposition analysis that uses the results of a model analysis with a known spectrum to calculate displacement and stresses in the model. For response spectrum analysis, it's important to select the prop mode completion method as this can affect the prediction of the peak response. Also, understanding the difference between periodic and rigid responses help us to properly combine the modes together. Additionally, in the case that we do not have sufficient effective mass extracted from the model analysis, we may need to account for the contribution of the missing mass. In this course, we'll explain how a response spectrum analysis is conducted along with the important considerations and techniques in mode combination. The lessons will consist of short video lectures followed by walkthrough demonstrations in ANSYS Mechanical, which you can follow along with the supplied simulation models. Each course will also include a practice quiz to test your understanding of the concepts covered in the lessons. Now, let's get started.